Hey guys, today I just received in from Amazon the LHS Vegetable Chopper. Now this is a chopper that's supposed to come with five different blades and it dices, it slices, it chops, and more. So let's get this out of the package, get it out of the box, and see what's inside. Okay, so this is what we see on the box. We have LHS vegetable chopper. It shows a picture of five different blades. On the side, it says, insert the blade. Place the food onto the blade and gently press down. So when we open the box, we are greeted with a thank you card. And the chopper with all the accessories inside. I'm gonna take this out of the plastic. And inside of that, we have a cleaning tool this looks like a hand guard so you would put your fruit or vegetables here and this would protect your hands from getting sliced off we have our we have three different blades here let's see what they are we have this one this one, and a slicer. And then we have two more. Choppers and graters. That's everything that comes in the box. Now, let me insert one of these blades into here. I believe this just goes in like this. And let's just choose one. I'll just choose this one for now. And it locks into place. And then I assume we just place like an onion or whatever vegetable we want, a potato. And all you do is press down. Once again, this is the LHS Vegetable Chopper, and this is everything that's included in the box. You get the top insert with the five different blades, a slicer, two graters, and two choppers, a hand tool to protect your hand so you don't slice it off, and a cleaning tool. It looks easy to use. I can't wait to give it a try. Hope you enjoyed the unboxing. Thanks. EasyBit presents, coming in at number 8 on our list, a reversible stainless steel blade adds strength and versatility to the Cuisinart Prep Plus, which has simple controls in the form of an intuitive touchpad panel. This device can handle both hard and soft foods, and all you have to do when you're done is wipe it clean. The plastic parts are BPA free, and there are three color options available. However, it's not especially long lasting. At number 7, Featuring a 21-ounce bowl that's ideal for personal meals, the Cuisinart Mini Prep generates some substantial power for a machine of such a compact size. A large ridge on the lid makes it easy to grip and lock into place, even with wet hands. This one includes a recipe booklet and a cleaning brush, but it is difficult to remove the blade. Moving up our list to number 6. The sleek silver body of the Proctor Silex chopper is sure to match the decor of any kitchen. It comes with a custom-built spatula that's just the right size for mixing your ingredients and removing the finished product without leaving much residue behind. This one comes with a bowl size adjuster, a lid with an opening for adding oil, and a one-year warranty. Halfway up our list at number 5. 
campers, RV owners, and anyone who likes to cook on the go should consider the Chef and Veggie Top. This hand-powered model requires no electricity. Simply pull the cord and the blades will spin fast enough to cut through fruit, nuts, and even ice. Its sealing lid keeps the contents fresh and it allows for precise control. This one's a particularly good choice for tiny kitchens. At number four, in addition to two stainless steel blades, the Posami Mincer features a nifty stirring mechanism that simplifies things like mashing potatoes and beating eggs. This model has a built-in safety lock and it comes with a one-year warranty. There are two capacity options and you can choose a glass or a plastic bowl. A silicone mat prevents it from skidding. Nearing the top of our list at number three, the Ninja Express is a nice little multi-purpose tool, suitable for anything from chopping garlic and herbs to cutting chocolate and cheeses. The bowl's capacity is 16 ounces, which works well for small dishes and appetizers. It's equipped with dishwasher-safe parts, a useful splash guard, and a head that fits comfortably in the hand. At number two, while some fancy models will try to impress you with extra bells and whistles, the Hamilton Beach Stack and Press takes a more workmanlike approach, and the results are impressive. Use it on veggies, fruits, herbs, nuts, or meats with confidence. It boasts a powerful 350-watt motor and a sleek, minimalist design. It's easy to assemble and clean. And coming in at number one on our list, the KitchenAid 3.5 cup doesn't just chomp veggies quickly, it leaves you with clean, even pieces that will make your dish both delicious and aesthetically pleasing. If you want to make sauces or salad dressings, you'll appreciate the built-in spout that makes pouring easy. This one comes in a variety of colors with a cord wrap for tangle-free storage, and it's dishwasher safe. Here is a quick video to show how to use the Briefton's Express Food Chopper. Please watch it in full as it will help you make the most out of your chopper. Component. The product comes with a pump, a cover, a bowl, a chopper blade, a mixer attachment, recommended usages. The chopper makes it easy to prepare chopped ingredients for soups, salads, pesto, hummus, salsa, guacamole, baby foods, among others. Chopping. Vegetables and fruits without a hard seed. Example, onion, carrot, potato, tomato, cucumber, bell pepper, kale, etc. Herbs. Example, garlic, spring onion, etc. Tip. If the food is too tough to cut with your knife, then it will be too tough for the chopper. Mixing. Eggs, flour, soup, cream, etc. How to use. Use one hand to hold the plastic shelf of the blade attachment and use the other hand to carefully remove the protective covers from the blades. Make sure your fingers are clear of the sharp edges of the blades at all times. Place the food chopper on a flat, stable surface and place the chopper blade on the nub at the center of the bowl. Use a knife to cut the food into chunks no longer or wider than one and a half inches, three to four centimeters. The smaller the chunks are, the quicker it will be to chop them later. If the food is hard, example, carrot, sweet potato, etc. Cut it further into smaller chunks.
scatter the chunks around the blade in the bowl. Make sure the chopper blade still sits upright and is not tilted to any side. Fit the cover flush on the bowl. Fit the pump onto the cover. Make sure the pump's base fits flush with the cover. The hex end of the pump should now be connected to the hex hole of the chopper blade through the cover. If the pump handle is in the locked position, release it as follows. One, use one hand to hold the pump handle. Two, use the other hand to slide the pump lock to the unlocked position. Push down on the pump repeatedly. This will cause the chopper blade to spin and chop the food. The more you push the pump, the finer the chopped foods become. Stop when the desired results are achieved. Important, if the chopper blade doesn't move freely, please try this. Open the cover. Remove some chunks from the bowl. Cut the chunks further into small pieces. Reposition large chunks around the chopper blade. Try again until the blade can move freely. Take out the chopper blade carefully before removing the chopped food from the bowl. To save space when storing the chopper, you can lock the pump handle down. One, use one hand to push the pump handle down and hold it. Two, use the other hand to slide the pump lock to the locked position. To mix foods, follow the above steps, but use the mixer attachment instead of the chopper blade. How to clean. It is recommended that the chopper be washed right after use. Hand washing is recommended to prolong the life of the product. Clean the pump by hand with warm soapy water. Do not put the pump in the dishwasher or submerge it underwater. All other parts of the chopper can be cleaned by hand or in a dishwasher, top rack only. Hand cleaning. Wash the parts with warm soapy water. Use a mild detergent if necessary. Use a brush to clean the chopper blade if necessary. Dishwasher cleaning. Place the bowl, cover, chopper blade, and mixer attachment in the top rack of the dishwasher. Important, do not put the pump in the dishwasher. Run the dishwasher on a normal cycle using standard detergent. Unfortunately, stains from vegetables such as carrots or beets are a relatively common issue with plastic products of this nature. Sometimes carrots or beets may leave stains on the chopper's plastic. When stains happen, you can remove them as follows. Use baking soda to clean the stain. Or mix a paste of baking soda and dish soap. Scrub it on the stain. Let it sit for 20 minutes. Scrub it again and rinse it thoroughly. Repeat as necessary until the stain is removed.